which are really, really invalid and without that actually people's lives is really vulnerable without We don't want a situation like in Ireland or in Poland where abortion's illegal or like in the USA where staff at abortion clinics get death threats. Over the last few years we've seen increasing numbers of right-wingers, religious right-wingers, thinking it's okay to stand outside an abortion clinic and harass women and tell lies and intimidate them, and we're not going to have it. A message to uh, the anti-choice uh, anti protesters that they are not going to be allowed to harass and intimidate women. We will resist them. No Bazaran! I'm here today because I think that it's a woman's choice um, whether she has an abortion or not and I don't think women who are in this situation to make the decision should be um, harassed by people. Not the church, not the state, women must decide their fate. Not the church, not the state, women must decide their fate. Not the church, not the state. of religion forcing women into dangerous positions in order to, to stop the future going backwards to backstreet abortions that put women's lives at risk. Hey, not the church, not the state. Women must decide their fate. Not the church, not the state. Women must decide their fate. Yeah. Why are you not out there campaigning for council 
affordable housing so that children can work in decent conditions instead of wasting your time targeting women. These people must know on some level the harm and the distress they are causing and yet they call themselves Christians and that they believe 